Alrighty guys, I got a big old Power Team Lowers order here. Um, lots of baits to go over, so um, I just opened it up. I tried to make it. I only got like 20 seconds in and I had like a cough attack, so I'm going to redo it. I only showed a few baits anyway, so I didn't really go through it all, so we'll start over here. Um, first off, we got the Power Team Lures sticker in just a black color. You can see it's got their saying on there, Power Team Lures Deadly on Bass. Nice sticker there. <clears throat> Up next, we got a pack of the 3.5 craw d'oeuvres in kitchen sink. Comes in an 8 count. Um, this is like a watermelon color, and it has lots of flake in there, guys. It's got uh, green and purple and black flake all around in the bait. So it's a nice, dirty color. And this I'm going to use to match up uh, Jeremy French's um, his custom color for the kitchen sink. So that would be a good uh, match up there. So there's that. Up next we got the 4.8 Sweeney Hammer Shad. This is in Casper Blue. Or Casper Blue Shad I should say. Comes in a 5 count. Um, I didn't really get to use these as much as I like to this year. Or uh, last year I should say. So this year I'm really going to uh, put them to use a little bit better. Uh, can't wait to use them. To be good on a swim jig trailer, uh, spinner bait trailer, just Texas rigged, weighted. Probably throw it on an Alabama rig too if you want for a bigger size bait. So there's a 4.8 Swinging Hammer and Casper Blue Shed. Um, here we got some lean drop shot weights here in 3 16th ounce, I believe. Yep. Uh, good for drop shotting, guys. Um, I did a lot of drop shotting this year. It was one of my most deadly method methods. Um, actually, I caught a lot of bass. They weren't all huge, but I did catch a ton of bass drop shotting. So um, that's a killer method if you guys haven't tried it out. Um, up next is the 3.5 Crow Derv again in Green Pumpkin Blue Swirl. Again, these come with uh, hog tonic capsules, as you can tell. So this is just a green pumpkin color, and it's got light blue swirl. Uh, my lighting's kind of bad, so it's kind of hard to see, but there's that. And again, that's going to match the uh, Jeremy French's color uh, jig as well. I'll actually show his jig right here since I have it out. That's what I'll be matching up with. This is actually a swim jig version. And if you actually turn this, it's got a light blue swirl in it. I'm not sure if you guys can pick it out or not, but um, it matches that perfectly. So, um, Up next here, another craw d'oeuvre in raw craw color. This is just a bright red color with a pepper black flake inside of this. And again, another color that I'm going to be matching up with uh, Jeremy French's uh, custom jigs. He did a custom color called Delta Destroyer for me. And if I want a jig or a trailer that stands out a little more in that jig, this is going to be it. It's a, just a little bit brighter red. And um, I'll show you the jig I'm actually going to be matching it with here. So here's the Delta Destroyer custom jig right here. You see it's that green pumpkin. And it's got that red on the bottom there. And if I want a trailer that just stands out a little more, I'm going to use this really bright red there, and I think it'll be a killer combo. So, there's that. Up next, we got two packs of the 3.5 Food Chain Tube and Adolescent Craw. This has got pepper black flake and a light purple flake in it, and again, hog tonic capsules. You get eight in a pack. Got two packs of them. Um, up next, we got a big old pro pack here. This is the uh, four point. 5 inch food chain tube, just solid green pumpkin with black flake. I'm going to be using this for punching a lot, and I actually used this for shaky heading in a pond, and I actually caught a really nice bass off shaky heading this tube as well, but in a different color, but um, most likely going to be using this for uh, probably uh, flipping and pinching and punching and stuff like that. I uh, can't wait to use it. Um, probably going to catch me some really nice fish uh, when the bite's tough, and this is a really meaty bait. Um, again, it's a really hard head design, so it's uh, going to hook really well. And you guys won't have any trouble there. So, 4.5 food chain tube, green pumpkin. Um, up next here, we got their uh, their grubs. This is the 4.5 inch grub in green pumpkin blue swirl. And it also has a uh, pepper black flake um, around the bait there. Uh, it's going to be a good spinner bait and... Uh, Swim jig trailer, that's what I'm going to be using them for. Um, I actually don't throw spinner baits that often, actually. Um, I'm not a fan of them. I didn't have confidence in them ever. My dad always fished them. Um, that's actually how I grew up fishing, because my dad did. And um, 
he was always throwing spinner baits and I would throw them too. He would catch all a bunch of fish. I wouldn't catch anything. So um, I'm learning to throw them and getting used to how to fish them, but I'm not a very confident person while throwing them. I always find different methods anyway, but I do have them in my box, but most likely these will be uh, swim jig trailers. So there's 4.5 grub, green pumpkin, blue swirl. Up next, another pack of their uh, craw d'oeuvres. This is in the Delta Destroyer color, just like the jig I showed you from Jeremy French. So it's a green pumpkin top, and it's got the red bottom to it. Gonna be a deadly combo. This has a uh, pepper black flake, and also it's got some, I wanna say blue flake in there as well, a bluish green tint to it. So that's gonna be a really nice combo. And the bottom also has a uh, red flake also. So, so it's got green and uh, red flake around the bait. 3.5 crowd d'oeuvre, Delta Destroyer, Pro Pack. Um, here we got another Pro Pack here. This is the 3.6 JP Hammershad. This is in a gill color. So it's a bluegill imitation. A lot to flake in there. You can see we got some green, got some purple in there. And I think that's about it. And I think it, when it hits a light, it kind of changes a little bit. It's like a gold flash to it, like a yellowish color. So. Again, this was a deadly method this year for me, uh, drop shotting these. It was really killer. Had amazing success on uh, this bait here. So there's that. <clears throat> Up next, another pack of Crow d'oeuvres and Susky Slayer. Um, again, it's like a green pumpkin color, purple and black flake on the top. And then it goes to this summer craw green, chartreuse looking color on the bottom. You guys can see that a little better there. Awesome bait guys, awesome color too, I love that color. Um, here we got a pro pack, more craw d'oeuvres. This is an adolescent craw. Again, it's got a black flake and purple flake in there as well. This is it's a light color. This color right here, also gonna match one of uh, Jeremy French's custom jigs that he uh, did for me. I'll show you guys it right here. Um, lighting's not very good, but this is a color he did. I mean, it looks just like it. And this matched up right there is going to be really killer. It's almost like a light purple looking color. It's uh, kind of hard to explain, like a brownish purple. It's really nice looking. And uh, I think that's going to be a deadly combo right there. So, Craw Derv, Adolescent Craw. Moving on. Here we got a Pro Pack. Um, this is in uh, Delta Destroy color. The bully grass devil. Again, the same uh, red flake in there and uh, the greenish blue tint to it. Um, I used these last year a little bit. I only had like one pack of them. I didn't have a pro pack. And uh, I did uh, punching at a pond with them and I had great success on these as well. So this is the bully grass devil in Delta Destroyer color. And uh, these are 4.5 inches, by the way, if you guys didn't know. So it's definitely going to be a good flip and punch and bait for sure. I uh, can't wait to use these. These were great for me. So, Bully Grass Devil 4.5 inch in Delta Destroyer. And um, here's another Bully Grass Devil again in uh, Green Pumpkin Scupper Swirl. Camera's not picking up that color very well. Just a darker Green Pumpkin looking color there. Uh, up next, we got the 5 inch ticklers. This is in uh, Oxblood with light red flake. Um, did really good on these in the bigger size in the 7 inch ticklers. And of course, I had to get them in the 5 inch size. I'm um, going to be deadly shaky head drop shotting bait for sure. Um, did really well on the 7 inch, like I said. So these are just going to be as good. So 5 inch tickler, Oxblood with light red flake. Another 5 inch tickler here. This is in their kitchen sink color. Good stained water bait. Again, has all that flake in there. Lots and lots of color flake. Gonna be a really nice bait as well. Moving on. Here we got some of their five inch six sticks here. Um, this is in green pumpkin purple flake. Just like the name, it's got black flake in there as well. And it's got light purple flake all through the bait. Um, used this same color last year. Did really well on it as well. I'm gonna get some weighted uh, wacky rig hooks. 
and uh, should be really well. I don't throw these very often, but when I do, it usually works out pretty well. And um, there's a good bait um, anywhere. They do catch catch some bass. So um, up next, we got the 4.5 Conviction Craw. This is in Delta Destroyer. Um, did super super well. This was probably my top bait of uh, 2013 in just green pumpkin color But I definitely had to go with the Delta Destroyer as well I got a ton of green pumpkin still and uh, I just knew I had to get some Delta Destroyer as well Just a sick color again green pumpkin top got that bright red to the bottom lots of red flake in the bottom and uh, That greenish blue flake on top as well um, This is gonna be a killer bait guys. I already know this for a fact um I'm going to be just Texas rigging it and using it as jig trailers a lot as well. And uh, I think it's going to do really well. So, again, this was probably number one bait of uh, my 2013 season. It probably caught me the biggest bass um, ever, probably around five pounds, I guess. I didn't get to weigh it, but I'd say it was at least five pounds easy, and it was during the spawn. So, 4.5 Conviction Crawl, Delta Destroyer. And here... We got a giant, giant pack here. This is two pro packs and one. Um, I'm actually gonna take these out for you. I think that's all for this order. Yeah. One second, guys. This is their brand new color in the 3.5 Texas rig jig. This is in green pumpkin grape swirl. Um, these just came out not too long ago, and I had to pick a bunch of them up, of course. Um, I can tell you my camera is not gonna pick it up as well as I'd like it to, but it's green pumpkin. Uh, grape swirl so it's that green green pumpkin and purple just like a pb and j kind of color and it's got a light blue flake all around the bait and a black flake in there as well same for the skirt there and i got a lot of these i can just texas rig these or if i want to use them in jig trailer i'm just going to cut the skirt off there and use it as jig trailers and it's going to be a deadly combo so got two pro packs in there and they came in a big old bag here so um, that is my uh, PTL order, guys. Um, hope you guys enjoyed all the stuff. Um, this this stuff is going to last me a long time, I can already tell you. I got so much stuff from them. So um, I'm just going to have to uh, get some more Plano boxes to put these in. So 3.5 Texas Rig Jig, Green Pumpkin, Grape Swirl just came out. Definitely check out that color. It's nasty looking. Uh, great, great looking uh, bait there. And uh, I did pretty well on these too last year. Um, I don't know if I did a lot of footage with these because it was early on. I don't know if I brought my hat cam all the time. But I did pretty well on those. So there's those. 4.5 Conviction Cross Delta Destroyer. Six Sticks Green Pumpkin Purple Flake. Five Inch Ticklers Kitchen Sink. More Five Inch Ticklers Oxblood with Light Red Flake. Those 4.5 Bully Grass Devils. Green Pumpkin Scupper Swirl, some more Delta Destroyer, um, more Craw D's here. This was in the uh, Adolescent Craw color. Craw D's, Susky Slayer. Just going over what I had already, real quick. Um, JP Hammer Shads in Gill, 3.6 inch version. Craw D's, Delta Destroyer, nasty color. I love that color. Some grubs, the 4 point inch, 4.5 inch uh, grubs in Green Pumpkin Blue Swirl. Sorry, I'm going kind of fast. 4.5 inch food chain tubes, solid Green Pumpkin. Uh, more food chain tubes here in Adolescent Craw. Nasty color. I love that color. Craw D's in Raw Craw. More craw d'oeuvres and green pumpkin light blue swirl. Got the lean drop shot weights there. 4.8 swinging hammer sheds and more craw d's in kitchen sink. So that's a ton of baits, guys. That's going to last me quite a long time. I'm probably going to get more, of course, as uh, it gets closer to the spring. Uh, I'll definitely be stocking up more, guys. So this is just the start of it. Uh, I think it's around $120. Um, most of them are pro packs. I'm guessing around 400 baits here, maybe 300, 400, somewhere in there. It's quite a bit. So um, hope you guys enjoyed that little unboxing. Um, sorry I went really fast at the end, but I just wanted to go over it again really quick for you guys. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. PTL, baby.